Why hello everyone. If you're coming back to watch another one of my videos, welcome back. If you are new to this channel, welcome. And I hope you enjoy the videos. I hope you enjoy this video. And if you'd like to see further videos, please do not forget to subscribe. Today's video is all about eclipses. Now, I'm not going to go into what's an eclipse, how rare they are, what is significant about eclipses. No, 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 no. Today's video is all about why you should go out and see an eclipse. And what I mean by an eclipse is a total eclipse, not a partial eclipse, a total eclipse. A total eclipse is when, is when basically the moon completely covers the sun. Now, when these events happen and they happen, let's say they happen in, in the US, if you're located in the US or in whatever country that you're in, and you're not in the area of totality, then you will get a percentage. And say hi to my cat. There we go. There we go. Yeah, he, like, he likes attention. Anyway, yes. If you are in the area of that is not totality, oftentimes the media will give you a percent, the percentage that will be co completely covered by the moon, whether it be 95%, 90%, 70%, 80%. And then if you want to look at it, they will tell you that you need special glasses and, or using a solar telescope to watch or see that part of that type of eclipse. Well, the special thing about total eclipses is that it is the only moment, the only true moment where you can see the sun unaided. Or more specifically, you can see the atmosphere of the sun unaided. When the moon completely covers the sun, that is the one time you can look in the direction of the sun without any type of equipment. You can see it with your own eyes. And this is significant because what I'm about to tell you is why you should go to an eclipse if you ever have the opportunity to see a total eclipse. It is one of the most beautiful moments I have ever seen in my life. It is a reason why in the history of this world, eclipses are viewed upon as an act of God if you believe in religion. It is one of the most magnificent things because it is literally, you see things changing in front of you at the moment of the eclipse. And no picture, no video does an eclipse justice. What happens during an eclipse, or as the moon approaches the sun during the final moments before totality, is that you will actually see the moon shadow coming toward you. As that shadow approaches, it starts to become dark. Animals start acting like it is night. Humans, because of what is happening, will start acting strange. When the moon completely covers the sun, you will be able to see planets if they are around the vicinity of the sun, you will be able to see stars. You will be able to see the corona. Now in pictures, you will notice that the corona, corona is stagnant, it's, it doesn't move. But during an eclipse, a total eclipse. The corona is in motion. And that makes sense because it is it's basically a part of the sun's atmosphere. And therefore, you will actually see the corona move. Imagine waves in an, oh, the waves of an ocean. How the waves are moving back and forth. The corona is like moves like similar like that in the sky. 
it moves back and forth. And this happens depending on where you are in the area totality. It can last minutes, it can last seconds. It is, it, it is absolutely amazing. And therefore, if you ever get a chance to see it, to see it, because it doesn't last long. And then once the moon continue on in its orbit, then you will have to put on glasses and then continue to watch the moon as it leaves the vicinity of the sun. But that's it. That is why. That is why you should see an eclipse. And after you see such an eclipse, the totality of an eclipse, all the other types of eclipses pale in comparison. Partial eclipses are not the same. Annual eclipses are not the same. It is an absolutely fabulous moment. And I was fortunate enough to wait. The reason I'm able to describe this to you is that I was fortunate enough to see the 2017 eclipse. And I was able to see it in Kansas City. And I was fortunate enough to see it at a park. And like I mentioned earlier, it is one of the most amazing things I have seen in my life. The image of that eclipse is seared into my mind. I can never forget such a thing. And therefore, if you ever have the opportunity to go to an eclipse, to see a totality of an eclipse, I suggest you do so. That is it for the video. If you like what you heard, please subscribe. If you don't like what you what you heard, please subscribe. And with that, I will see you soon.